Hi guys, welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to upload your video directly from Filmora 9 to YouTube. And I also, uh, I also tell you, tell you the reason why you should not do that. I never do that before. So this is the first time I'm, I'm going to do that. And okay. So first thing first, I go to Filmora. Uh, this is Filmora. I, I'm currently using Filmora screen recorder to record my screen. So when you finish your editing work, you go to export, right, right here, export the project. I click on that, and you see that uh, here we have local device, YouTube, Vimeo, DVD. Uh, but normally, I go to local and I select MP4, and then I type the name of my video and also select a folder but uh, my default folder and go to setting and I select the correct frame rate and also the bit rate and the quality then I click OK and I go back to export when this is finished I check the video again and then I save it to my computer and then I upload it to YouTube manually just log into my account and upload the video that's what I did but you have another option here go to youtube and here filmora allow you to put the title for example this is uh, tiktok effect just an example and you can write the description for your video uh, of course you have to write yourself so this is the description and also you can put tags on this uh, I can uh, replace this and film more and I take talk or something like that for privacy I can uh, save it to uh, select public or unlisted or private it's up to you so this is a new new feature of Fimora 9.5 so you uh, you are able to put it in unlisted uh, category uh, or private so I will put it in unlisted okay and the quality I can also change the setting uh, right here with the same the same setting I just uh, I just uh, showed you okay bitrate also we go well with 20k 20,000 kilobit per second and frame rate with 24 okay let's click OK so the setting is okay and also the category we we cannot uh, select the category uh, now because uh, I have not signed in so we sign in click here to sign in and of course you need in your internet connection and there are so many errors here so uh, here they will have uh, they will ask you to uh, log in to your account your YouTube account okay and if you want to learn more about privacy you can click here because uh, this is in Vietnamese but you can click here privacy I will click on that So this is Wondershare privacy policy, and I read through this carefully, and I didn't I didn't see anything about how they protect our account, uh, our YouTube account. So all the information here is about the license, about how they sell the license, about the copyright, and just something about the license of the software, how they sell the software, how they protect the software, and how they collect your information, such as such as credit card and uh, how how they use them okay so you can read through all of this information uh, regarding personal data collected phone number company name all the information payment information and purpose and legal basics of the processing so you you can you need to read this before you sign in, into your account okay and in my opinion and my personal experience I do not recommend you to do so because when you when you sign in sign to your YouTube account uh, with with Fimora 9 then you give your account information to Wondershare so they keep it on their server so they say it's safe but who knows maybe a, an expert a hackers or something like that or their server is uh, being hacked and uh, they cannot protect your account so what what should you do I never never do that especially uh, for my main channel for, uh, Jackie Nguyen I never um, 
send my inform uh, the the uh, login information to any third party. What the share is just a third party. Uh, I don't say that I don't believe them, but I believe them. I trust them. Uh, however, uh, to reduce the risk, I have to face it. So I never put my information to them. So I recommend it not doing, uh, not uploading your video directly from Wondershare. But at this time, I I'm, I will I will do that. I will log in it and publish it uh, on my YouTube uh, channel. Just to show you an example. If anything happened to me, then I will let you know. Okay. So I risk my life. I risk my life to to sign in to to uh, Fimura and I uh, with my YouTube account and to let you know and be, be sure that you need to read this before before you sign in into your account okay and let's do it now I'm going to uh, my name Go ahead okay so I have to to step verification okay so I need uh, my phone to log into my account I click yes this is going to share one to access your Google account this is from Google uh, this will allow Wondershare Fimura to manage your YouTube video that's bad thing right view your YouTube account also bad things make sure you trust Wondershare Fimura uh, to be sharing if you can learn more learn about the risk here right here and if I click allow then they have access to my account okay I will do that now allow and loading mm -hmm. so there's security security alert on my phone okay and now we uh, we can uh, we can export now so they will export and upload it to uh, youtube so it's converting file so it's happen again uh, normally now I, I will open my youtube account and uh, see this video okay so make sure that you have internet connection otherwise you will make errors all the time or like this I will log in now, but uh, I will not show you on the screen. So this is my account. Okay, so they here here is the the video. It is processing, so zero percent is processing uh, right now in Wondershare. Okay, step so upload completed, total one hundred percent, and this is a URL. You can also find the target. Uh, let's find the target. And it's saved in upload in Wondershare Fimura 9. So this is the video, the video, my video on my computer. And this is the video on my channel. So monetization is off and unlisted. I can now edit it. Okay. Okay, so here is the title and description, uh, thumbnail and unlisted. I can publish this now, but I, I will not publish it. And you can add and screen and card and also put tag and also have more option. And finally, you can click save and that finished the process. So in conclusion, it's easy. It is easy to upload the video directly from Fimura 9 to YouTube, but uh, you should not do that because uh, I, I don't think you should risk your uh, information. Uh, by providing uh, your account to an, a third party like Wondershare or other any other party on the internet because they can keep the uh, they can keep your information on their server and who oh no, you should keep it yourself not put it on their server it's risky it's very risky okay that's that's all I want to share with you in this video thank you very much for watching and I will see you in my next video bye for now